Hey, honey buns, it is Jen, and I want to come in and talk about how you can brand your braiding business for 2020. Yes, things you can do before 2020 hits so that your business can be ready for 2020. Now, let's go ahead and do a little bit of housekeeping first, okay? I need you guys, if you are a brand new bra braider, I need you to go ahead and sign up for braid hairforcash.com you can either one get my replay of how i started my braiding business with ten dollars or you can go ahead and join the braid for cash course whole bunch of dope stuff going down in there hope to see you guys there link in the description let's get into it all right things that you can do to bring your business for 2020 one thing you can do is you can start you a youtube channel yes ma'am i said start you a youtube channel now here's the thing about a youtube channel you don't have to necessarily be on camera you can do a tutorial where you literally show someone how to do a hairstyle and that is so capitalizing right now you guys and if you guys don't want to be on camera your customer don't want to be on camera you literally can set your camera up where you're not seen and your customer is only seen from the side so that's something that you might want to think about another thing you can do is just a watch with me this is not a tutorial it's really watch me work video this is where you're recording and they're seeing you do a hairstyle and these videos right now at this moment are very popular on youtube some of these braiding videos have upwards to a million views girl get in on that stop playing okay and you can also have a video where you just tell people about your prices tell them about some of the basic things that you do and it gives you an opportunity to tell people about your booking info hey follow me on instagram hey email me hey slide in my dms Follow me on Facebook. And this is going to set you apart from other braiders because most other braiders don't have a YouTube channel. As much as a lot of people say everybody does YouTube, really, not a lot of people doing YouTube. So as a braider, I need you to dominate and get your tail on YouTube. The second thing that I want you to go ahead and do is get omnipresent, okay? Omnipresence means you are everywhere. You give the illusion that you are everywhere. And this is often because a lot of these social sites, if you put in like, braider in new jersey and you have that in all of your bios on all of your social medias guess who's gonna show up you but you'll really show up if you are at on all these social media so if you have facebook twitter linkedin all these pinterest a, a page on on twitter i mean a page on a business page on facebook you can provide omnipresence so what i want you to do is pause this video no 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 watch the whole video don't play with me i'm gonna get you if you leave <laughs> Watch the whole video, but I want you to go after you watch this video, go and get yourself registered and sign up for all these top social media sites because you want to come up when they put Braider in your city, you need to be coming up, okay? And the last thing that I, you can do to brand yourself in 2020 is this is the time for you to brag, boo. I need you to brag. And what I mean is that in your bios, for you to brand yourself, you need to be telling the people about the time. When I say time, I'm actually talking about either the time you have braided or the time it takes you to do a hairstyle. Because a lot of people, when they pay you to do their hair, they don't want you to be taken forever. They want you to do it in a nice amount of time. And that's something that you can do. Also, it's good for people, if you are a old school braider, it's great for you to say, hey, by the way, I've been doing hair for five years, 10 years, 15 years, because that gives people comfort to know that they're in good hands with you because you've been doing hair for a long time. You're like, you know what, Jen? I ain't been doing hair for a long time. What can I say? You can tell them about your specialty. What do you do? Can you do designs? Can you do tender head? Can you do kids? Can you do guys? Do you know how to do fox locks, Havana twists, whatever it is you know how to do your specialty? This is your time to brag about it. Why? Because you need to be booked and braiding. So you need to tell people about what you do. And the last but not least, tell them, do you have a traveling option? Are you willing to travel to their house? Can you travel 30 miles away from where you are to them? Let them know this is your time to brag. And that puts you in a great place place and that specializes you and that's the way you can brand yourself in 2020 as a braider so start a youtube channel get all your social media sites registered and ready and brag about yourself so you guys make sure you guys are going ahead signing up for my braid for hair braid hair for cash sign up now and these are ways that you can go ahead and brand your business brand your braiding business in 2020. I'll be talking to you guys later. Bye, y'all.